For doing murals, I usually just use uh, exterior latex house paint. Probably between 30 and 50 gallons of paint, and it probably took me about 300 hours, I guess. So I get like 50 different colors at a time, so the people that are in line behind me aren't too appreciative of it. But you gotta do what you gotta do. And I've been to a lot of other cities where everything's kind of homogenous, and, and this isn't one of those cities, and I'm happy. Any good piece of art and a piece of art that works, the viewer wants to be in it somehow. They want to interact with it, and a lot of times they do that by seeing a piece of themselves within that piece of artwork. It's like the community. You know, different people, races, all different nationalities. To me, it's like unity. Especially a piece like this, I really tried to put something in it for everybody. It looks like he's really playing the drums. It's so bright, it's just Miami. Because I figure everybody's gonna be walking by it. That's beige, right? Beige it'll be. It's giving me a little constructive criticism. He said it should be all beige. So it should be like a, almost like a communal piece. I hear everyone is uh, represented. But on the street, you really get a, a nice interaction with all the people. How long did it take you to do that? About two hours. Two hours? <laughs> no, two months, about six weeks. Beautiful. In the course of time that I was here, I got to know probably 50 people on a daily basis. Perfecto, gracias. You want one? She comes bringing me coffee every day, whether they're waiting for the bus or walking by, going home from work. Hey, look, there's another bus. Yeah, I think that the work has a very literal meaning and a very symbolic meaning. The literal, I mean, it's just people from the community, different elements of, of what makes this city what it is. And the symbolism is, to me, it's just layered within it. Postmodern cartoon expressionism. The overall message is just eat more ravioli, is what it all boils down to and I'm putting a lot of love into it, and I'm getting a lot of love back from the people. I love it. You know, and, and to me, that just makes me feel like I'm doing the right thing. Hopefully this will be a thumbnail sketch for what will become my Sistine Chapel, hopefully one day.